I would say being a senior, I knew I had to step up for the team and they would be looking to me a lot. So I guess because it was my senior year, I kind of just left it all out there and played free and loose. Yeah, they're a younger group and uh, basketball is not really their main sport. So I knew I would have to go out there and if I tried my hardest, they would follow what I did. So it worked out pretty well. At heart, she may be a soccer player at a volleyball school, but Ashlyn Hass's basketball impact isn't easily dismissed this past winter. The assist leader and second leading scorer on a squad that finished three games over 500 and with a nine and seven mark in conference. But finding a path to success, regardless of the endeavor, has simply become an Ashlyn default. I've always been involved in sports ever since I was young, so it's always just been a routine for me to go do your schoolwork, come home, go to sports. It's just that's something I've always done. Be it that soaring 3.94 GPA. I always try to do my best in the classroom because I know it'll pay off for me. And or her time spent volunteering to causes in Fort Madison, as well as her other sports. An ethic honed working construction for the family business. Yeah, definitely. Like when you're out working in the heat or, you know, it's just... I like seeing like starting the project and then seeing it finish, you know, seeing it through. I just, I like that. And while she was forced to miss out on her first sports love this spring. It's been pretty hard. I mean, to lose out on your senior season's not, you know, anything that anybody would want. But when I learned that I wouldn't get my high school season, I started focusing on college and getting prepared for college. Both her soccer future at Indian Hills. Um, my plan is to go to Indian Hills and hopefully get an offer after my two years there. But when I get there immediately for practices, you know, I'll give it my all in practices and uh, I know I can contribute to the team. I feel like I have a really good opportunity to grow there, get some really good minutes and learn a bunch. And her educational path forward remain a bright light. I'm going to get my associate's degree from there and then hopefully go on and finish out to get my be able to be a personal trainer. And so I will just have like that to fall back on if the sports career with soccer doesn't pan out. What's the personal trainer interest? Is that always kind of been something that's kind of stuck in your mind? Yeah, because with the sports that I do, you always have to be involved in lifting and staying in shape. And I just started lifting like my freshman year because of cross country and I kind of fell in love with it from there. I just I like the challenge that it gives you and I just enjoy it.